Well, the restaurant came about three years ago or so. Um, this was after maybe a year or two of um, myself and Jack going to farmers markets and uh, cooking food that was bought at farmers markets and then the following week taking it back and selling it as finished foods. We became really good friends with lots of producers in the area, Brand North Somerset. And then basically what happened is uh, this place came up and we came and had a look and it turned out that there was a cafe at the top. The next minute we knew we were funny restaurant and a side business, apple juice business. Well, the, the restaurant is within a walled garden. It's, uh, the garden is in an orchard which has about 80 varieties of uh, British heritage apples in it. The book became a diary, really, for, for a year here. It's really, it's just a kind of vision of what we're doing here. It's a bit of a window into the walled garden. The book is divided into four sections, um, which relate specifically to each season in the year. The ingredients we get from the garden are pretty endless because Mark uses a glass house, he uses polytunnels, uh, he has his business where he grows again heritage and organic and heirloom varieties of uh, British produce. Um, we buy directly from him. He, he grows some of the best produce that we've come across and he's actually introduced a lot of produce to us that we never knew about. Complete joy to be working alongside with him. If we can't get them from him we're using a community farm just down the road. All the food has to be seasonal, so we're effectively trying to show that you can have a lovely meal without incurring any food miles. Uh, we try not to get anything flown in, um, so it's local, seasonal, ethical. So the kind of things that we've got in the book, lots of really interesting but simple recipes. We do a lot of smoking and curing in the restaurant, so there's cured roe deer, we serve that with wood sorrel and clamped carrots. Uh, there's rabbit, which is one of our biggest sellers. People absolutely love the rabbit, it's phenomenal. Lamb that we serve with sea vegetables. Uh, we've got goat bacon, which is our, one of our signature, signature dishes that people come and ask about quite a lot. We've got cocktails in each season, loads of really interesting salads. And then we've got like, quite classic British puddings, so steamed puddings, chocolate brownies and salt caramel. With, with us writing the book, what I'd like to do is just inspire people about locality and seasonality and about British produce um, because we have such fantastic produce on our doorstep that hopefully will educate people and inspire people to, to use that a bit more. Yeah, we just hope to, to improve people's techniques and there's, there's a lot of technique-driven recipes so hopefully people will learn a lot about that and it'll better their cooking.